You've heard a lot lately about dogs and cats who need homes, but a local animal sanctuary is working with another animal. They're trying to rescue nearly 100 pigs. As CBS 17's Maggie Newland reports, the pigs, along with some other animals, are being removed from a property in Duplin County. Blind Spot Animal Sanctuary in Rougemont is home to all kinds of creatures, from emus to alpacas, peacocks, <coughs> to pot belly pigs. <coughs> there are plenty of pigs, including this group rescued just days ago from Duplin County. So we got a phone call from Duplin County uh, Animal Control and Sheriff's, from Sheriff's Department that they got alerted for to a to a hoarding situation. Alex Dainrich with Blind Spot and Joseph Purington with Sisu Refuge say they saw nearly 100 pigs on the property. Living in squalor, uh, basically, uh, poor shelter, no direct access to water, no consistent access to an abundance of food, living in their own feces. Uh, it, it brings uh, tears to your eyes. Seeing animals in this kind of situation is just heartbreaking. They removed more than a dozen animals in immediate need of care, including these pigs and this dog. But getting all of the pigs off the property and getting them the health care they need is a major and expensive effort. Several sanctuaries and rescues across the southeast are working together in a coalition called Operation NC Freedom. We need to get those animals out as quickly as possible. The pigs will eventually be available for adoption, but rescuers say it's vital that adopters can take proper care of them. <laughs> We do a background check. We do a veterinarian check. Even the littlest piglets grow up to be much bigger, and they need safe homes for their whole lives. Potbelly pigs can age up to 27 years. This is a long, lifelong commitment. And Operation NC Freedom is looking for volunteers from the community to help care for and transport the pigs. They're also looking for donations of supplies as well as help with vet bills and food. If you're interested in finding out more or potentially adopting, we have links on our website, cbs17.com. And one note, you do have to have more than one pig in your home. Angela.